inside. In there, 0 and 1. Here comes the 0 1. Takes a look at a strike over the inside corner. Looking for the strikeout, here's the 0 2 pitch. This is line to left. And a base hit, so the leadoff man is aboard. The throw into second. And he'll pull into second here with nobody out. Managers these days like to think of that nine-hole hitter as the 11. second leadoff man, Roger and he plays the role Davis. pretty well right here. Gets the leadoff double, and now he gives the real leadoff man a chance to bring him home. Here's Rajay Davis now. He's one for two in the ball game. A couple of righties starting to loosen now in the bullpen. He's set. Here it comes. Right over the middle, knee high. Here's the 0 1. Takes a fastball on the inside corner. He's in a tough spot right now, 0 and 2. This is one of those at bats. You look back and you go, I got to get the man over. But now 0 and 2, you just got to try to make contact now. And a swing and a miss there on a late breaking slider as he set down on strikes for the second time this afternoon. Here's Jed Lowry now. One for two with a double on the ledger so far. He's ready. Here's the first offering. Leaves a slider up high, but it's taken for a strike. Three runs, seven hits, and no errors in the ballgame for the A's so far. Chop foul over towards the coaching box. Oh, Matt, I think he thought he's going to get another breaking ball right there. He's a little bit late on that fastball. That's a nice pitch, though, following that breaking pitch to keep him off balance with the heater. The 0 2 home lifted in the air out towards left center. Kiermeyer giving chase, but he's not going to get there, and he's headed for extra bases again. And the run will score from second base as they open it up now 4 to 1. So much of this game is situational well, hitting, guys. 10. Nice job Shortstop. there. Yeah, you've got to find a way to pick your teammates up when you're given the chance. And he doesn't try to do too much right here. He just takes what's there safely on second, and his buddy is high-fiving teammates in the dugout. Standing in now, Marcus Simeon, as he looks at a fastball that's in there for strike one. 0 for 2 from him so far in this one. Hit well down the left field line, but back into the crowd foul. Open to send him packing. Pitch on its way. Swing and a liner. And that's in there. Base hit. And the runner from second will stay put at third. So they're runners at the corners now with one away. Now well, that base hit right third, there extends his Ryan. streak to nine Kingley. games. Now, we've been watching him. That's a couple series now. He's starting to swing the bat. You've got to start paying attention to this guy. He's getting hot. First delivery to him on the way. Ryan Healy stands in for the third time now as he takes a look at a ball. It's 1 and 0. Oh. He's certainly giving up plenty of hits in this one, but the funny thing is he hasn't walked anyone yet. That tells me he's throwing strikes, but he's just not throwing enough quality strikes. Here's the 1 and 1 pitch. And he's in front of a tight little slider that time. So he threw the slider darting away to him two times in a row. Now I don't think he'll go for it again. I'm looking for something hard inside on this pitch. Looking for the strikeout. Here's the one two. He got him. And it'll probably take a base hit now to get that runner across from third. All right fielder number 21. Digging in once Steven. again. Stephen Bolt. And we'll see what he can do here with a pair of runners on base and two gone here in the fifth. From the stretch. 
A fastball right down the middle for a strike. Well, the problem today has not been throwing strikes. He has been around the plate. And he's been throwing strikes. Take this for example. The first pitch strike to the hitters today, 90% of the time has been a strike. He just doesn't have good stuff today. There's a swing and a drive hit well out to right field. Souza going back on it. He's there to track it down, and that'll end the inning. The sights and sounds of a day at the ballpark. Oh, my goodness. We're back to the Coliseum right after this. In is the third baseman, Evan Longoria. He'll start things out Getting in the sixth the for a lineup that third really baseman, hasn't found its groove Evan in this one. Longoria. Yeah, only two hits so far, Matt, and not very many hard hit balls either. We'll see if they can start making some adjustments. Oh, that's one he's going to want back right there. A fastball right in your wheelhouse, and you foul it. And this is going to be extra bases here leading off the sixth. Not in time, and he's in there with a double. When you're struggling as a team to put the ball in play, every base hit is welcome, but a double will really help wake everyone up. That's just their third hit of the game, but it's a good one. Comes set, and the 0-1. Sharp slider that time, just missed inside. Now that's that old school slider right there, trying to get in on his hands. We see that with a cutter a lot, but the slider's even more effective because you can't pick up the spin. He's set and the 2 1 pitch. Now a swing and a ground ball. Tried to fool him with the changeup, but he won't offer at it. 3 and 2. Wilson Ramos waits on deck. Good job to spoil that one away, and he stays alive. Working for the punch out and the offering. And another foul ball. <clears throat> He's right on that breaking ball. That's pretty good timing right there, especially falling up after a fastball. Checked his go. swing there, and did he go? No, he did not, says the third base umpire. So it's ball four. The catcher, number 40. Lifted in the no, air to right field. Uh -huh. Boom. Giving chase. He gets there to put it away, but the runner tags and breaks for third. And he'll move up to third now. Runners at the corners here with one away. Striding in once again, Trevor Plouffe. He's 0 for 1 thus far. They'll try and entice him with a high fastball, but he wouldn't commit. That it's ball one. With the infield back and a runner at third, he's definitely pitching for a strikeout or maybe something like a harmless pop-up. You could see it from that high fastball, but that was just a good job of laying off that pitch. Three and oh now. Sixth inning. Four to one is our score. Takes a look at one catching the outside corner. Three and one with two on, and this is where you, you got to be geared up for something to drive. I don't think you can just groove in one right here. You still have to try to. And the runner from third crosses the plate. It's now a 4 2 game. Well, he hung that one and he didn't miss it. That's number seven, Logan Morrison. Here comes Bob Melvin now out of the Oakland dugout. And that's going to be all for Sonny Gray. So he'll leave with the lead. Can't lose this one, but he is responsible for the two runners out there. So he could get a no decision if they were to come around and score. Daniel Kaloum takes the mound to try now to get out of this mess. Athletic. There are Number two on 35. with only one away. Daniel. Logan Hello. Morrison is in for the third time now as he takes a. Set to deliver the 0 and 1. And this ball's heading for the seats down the right side as the count will move to 0 and 2 now. Looks like a right hander's gotten enough to throw now in the Oakland pen. Runners are at first and second with one away. Another one sent foul. Well, that's three foul balls in a row. He's definitely battling up there. And this one's chopped foul right at home plate. The 0 2 once more. Swing and a miss on the breaking pitch. Two away. Digging it. Into 
Hollywood try it again. Steven Souza will see if he can come through in a clutch spot here. Two on, two out here in inning number six. Here comes the 0 1. Start of that swing a bit too early. Masterful job of changing eye levels. Fastball up and in, and then a curveball down. And we'll have to leave it there. This is strike three, and that will retire the side. Rays will settle for just the one.